everybody and welcome to El Arte de Endulzarte. Today we are going to prepare cinnamon rolls. The ingredients that we need for the dough are butter, milk, eggs, flour, sugar, a normal sugar, and bakery yeast. Have to be bakery yeast. So now we are going to see the filling ingredients. These are the ingredients for the filling. Butter are the ingredients for our cinnamon rolls. Brown sugar. Cinnamon. And a layer of flour. Now we are going to start with this recipe. First, heat the milk in a casserole. With the sugar and with the butter too. We have to dilute this. We have to dilute it in the head. Now that it's diluted, you can remove this from the head. And now we are going to put the half, only the half of the flour the bakery yeast we have to put this in a bowl and now mix okay mix this twice these ingredients and now we are going to add the mixture of uh, milk, sugar and butter. These have to be cold. When we are going to put on the flour, this has to be cold, okay? Have to be cool. Now we are going to mix with this, so mix this. Now that is mixed, we are going to add our eggs and okay mix again this all have to be well mixed when it's well mixed finally we are going to add the other half of the flour So now, add the other half of the flour. And mix again to make, to make the dough. Now continue mixing for 
uh, four or five minutes. Now we have here our dough and we have to let us stand this for an hour on or an hour and a half. Now we are going to continue with the other part. We are going to put in a bowl the butter, the brown sugar, the cinnamon, and finally the flour. And we have to mix this only with two knives. We have to mix with two knives. So, mix this. Have to be with two knives. We can make this mixture with another utensil. Okay, continue mixing. And now we have here our mixture. It's well mixed, it's okay. Now, this is perfect. Our dough is okay, it's perfect, as you can see. Now, put flour, we have to put flour. Put flour on the work table. Put flour on your hands too. And now we have to, to put the, the dough. And now we are going to stretch the dough. We have to stretch the dough. You have to stretch the dough as I can, as I doing this. Okay, we have a lot of dough, so stretch well you can see here my dog Now we are going to add the filling to the dough. And we have to extend, we have to, to put in all the dough. You can extend this with a knife if you want. And after that you can use your hand if you if you want. You can make it as I I've made. So continue. And now 
we are going to use our hands because it's more easy and better. So, continue. It's fun with with the hands. It's fun to to make this, and we can we can say to our kids to make this because it's very fun for for day. It's very fun. So continue with this. And after that, we are going to to wrap. Or make our rule. We have to make our cinnamon rules. So continue with this. We have to to have all the dough stand. And if it's necessary, we can cut the edge to leave it perfect. And I think I'm going to, to make this, because it's perfect. So continue with this. And now we are going to cut the edge. Okay. With a knife, we are going to cut this dough that we got. We can use for bake too. Cut another edge and the other. It's perfect, so we are going to wrap this to make our cinnamon rolls. So, wrap all the dough for make our roll. Wrap all. Now we have our cinnamon rules here, it's wrapped. So we can put a lot of butter, for example. We are going to put butter on the tray to prevent the sticking of the cinnamon rule. So put butter on your tray. We are going to use two trays because we have a lot of rules here, we have a lot of dough to bake. We have to put butter in all the tray. We have to to have sure that all the tray have butter. And okay. Now we are going to cut our cinnamon rolls. The size can be as you as you want. Okay, bigger or smaller. We have here now one. My size is the size of these cinnamon rolls are um, one finger approximately. And now we have to put cinnamon rolls in all the, the tray.
continue cutting. Now that we have this, we are going to let it stand for uh, 30 minutes only because this makes that our cinnamon rolls uh, can be bigger. Our cinnamon rolls are going to be bigger if we let it stand. So let it stand for 30 minutes. Now this is perfect and we have to preheat the oven uh, at 190 degrees and we have to put this only for 25 minutes. Now we are going to, to make another, another thing with icing sugar as you can see here I show you and now we are going to put a cream so we have to to use a hundred of icing sugar and four tablespoons of a cream and we have to mix this if it's necessary we are going to to add water so now we have here the water because i think it's necessary okay. continue mixing and now we are going to put a little of water only a little okay continue mixing and if it's necessary again, we are going to put more water. But little by little. Okay, another little of water. And mix this. And it's okay. I think now it's okay. You can see here how it's low, how we looks so this is how it looks we have to to have this exactly okay and it's perfect now we have here our cinnamon rules that now it's cold okay we have to let it cold after the baking and now we put the other that we we make before this. So put on the cinnamon rolls. And this is sweet and this is perfect. It's perfect for eat with kids. It's perfect for for all time or parties. We have to put a lot of icing sugar with cream. And now it's okay. We have this. This is okay. We have our cinnamon rolls. We have to clean this. I'm going to clean this. Okay. Clean this too. Okay. We have here, here our cinnamon rules. I hope you like it. Uh, I hope you you click on the like button. You can subscribe here to my YouTube channel. You can find me on Facebook and Twitter too. And you can see this recipe on my blogger too. You have my Facebook, blogger and Twitter here in the description. See you soon with another recipe and share with your family and friends.